I'm so particularly interested in um, because I know it's a studio class. My class is a studio class, and um, so they don't have a textbook, mm -hmm. and the reading they do is very few and far mm -hmm. between. And I'm just curious about like how do how to operate in the room to like model critical race theory in a way of um, because it's it's already a power imbalance. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. It, because students are coming to the room with an idea of what the teacher is and the this and that, you know, it's kind of getting in the way of, sometimes I feel like right. we're crossing each other because they can't see that I'm welcoming, welcoming them to participate in a way that they're maybe not used to. Mm -hmm. So there gets, it gets confused. So they're waiting for you to like do top-down knowledge when you're really trying to be more participatory and allow them to be... Right. Right. Which is very CRT, I, actually. I, it's I like, value that. Yeah. I value that. And um, so it's like, I'm particularly looking for help in that. And sometimes presenting materials that aren't the materials they're used to seeing, or presenting materials from different, well, the same materials, but from different perspectives in terms of art history, that can be helpful. But it still doesn't quite. Sandy, have, do you ask them, instead of you starting off being the one presenting, do you ask them to bring things in and let them share them first before you talk? Um, the, you mean on the first, not on the first day? Not on the first day, obviously. The first day is, yeah. yeah. For instance, the first okay. assignment I give them mm -hmm. is, you know, we're do, they don't have their materials and whatever, and I give them all a new big pen and a big piece of paper. I say, go ahead, and I don't care if you just scribble. Just whatever you bring, and that's a really good thing because it's like they really bring themselves to that, and that mm -hmm. helps mm -hmm. actually. Mm -hmm. Is it drawing or what it's art? Drawing, okay. drawing. Right? I have a lot of ideas. For, yeah, I don't want to dominate though, but I have a lot of ideas. You know what I always do whenever I want to teach, like in that modality, is like I, I suss out myths of like myths that people have about mm -hmm. ideas, mm -hmm. or I ask a question that is maybe like unexpected. So do you ask them things like, what do you think is art? Who gets to judge what is good art? Yeah. Or like Google, why don't you, your assignment is to Google great art. What do you see? And who gets to choose? You know, things like that. Like, yeah. where's the yeah. media? Like, where did you get your ideas of what great art was? Mm -hmm. yeah. I think that that's the yes. CRT lens. Because mm -hmm. like, did you get it from your family? Did you get it from the top 10 list that's, you know, on Google?